Hey guys, in this video I'll show you guys how to change app icons on your iPhone. So if you want to change your app icons on your iPhone, and what I mean by that is adding a uh, custom app icon. So let's say I wanted to change the Instagram app icon or YouTube app icon, I would change the button that shows up right here. So if you want to do that, then I'll show you guys exactly how to do it in this video today. But first things first, you want to make sure that you have the shortcuts app downloaded. So it should automatically come on all iPhones. But if you can't find it anywhere, you can go to the App Store and download it by searching up Shortcuts. Now, once you make sure you have the Shortcuts app, you're going to want to go to a browser and search for an app icon. So you can search for a specific app icon if you want, or you can just search for in general. Uh, if you look around a bit, you'll be able to find app icons that just give you a ton of them for every single app. But you can just go through and uh, browse a bit, look for app icons that you like. If you want a specific app, then you can search for it like I did here. But once you find the app icons that you want, you're going to want to click on that photo right there and save it to your gallery. So let's say I like this app photo right, or Instagram icon right here. I'll save this to my gallery. And once you save it your, to your gallery, you're going to want to go back to home. Once you go back to your home screen, from here, you're going to want to go to the Shortcuts app. If you click on the Shortcuts app, it brings you this page here. In the top right corner, there should be a plus icon. Click on it. Once you click on it, this page will show up here. Here, you want to look for the options that says Open App. As you can see, it shows up right here for me, but you can also search it up. Once you do that, you want to choose the app right next to the Open option, and you want to find the app that you want to add the icon to. So since I'm going to do the Instagram icon, I choose Instagram. Once you do that, do that, you choose Done in the top right corner, and try clicking on your shortcut to make sure it works. So if you click on the shortcut, it should bring you to Instagram. So as you can see, it just brought me to Instagram, so it does work. So as you can see, it does work. So now what you want to do, you want to click on the three dots at the top of that shortcut right there. And if you click on that, then it will bring you back to the shortcut to edit it. And once it brings you back to the shortcut to edit it, you're going to want to search, uh, click on the uh, shortcut sometimes crashes as well for me. So it might do that for you as well. But you don't have to worry. It normally saves automatically. But you want to click on the share button in the bottom right corner of the shortcut. And once this page shows up here, you want to look for the option to add it to your home screen. So as you can see, it's right here. So click add to home screen. Once you do that, if you click on the, the two blocks on top of each other in the bottom left or in the middle of the screen, then you'll be able to add a photo to the app or the icon. So click on that. And once you click on it, it'll ask you to choose a couple options, but you just want to choose photo. Now add the photo that you just saved from Chrome or the browser and it will add it to the app icon so it now shows the icon as this instead. Now you can add the name of the app underneath it as well. So just change the name of it from open app to Instagram or whatever app you're choosing. And once you do that click net done in the top right corner and it will now save it as that. Now if you go to your home screen, uh, let me go there real quick. And once you go to your home screen you should be able to find the app or the open app uh, shortcut in your home screen. As you can see, it shows right, right here. And if you click on it, it'll bring you straight to Instagram. So that is how you add it to your home screen. So uh, there's a couple other options you can do in the shortcuts as well. So you can look through that and choose any that you want to do. Uh, but uh, once you do that, you can actually remove the actual Instagram app from your home screen. So you can hide it and you can just use the shortcut. And to do that, if you go back to your home screen, then you will be brought to this page as normal. And you're going to want to swipe to the Instagram app or the open Instagram app shortcut and bring it over to where you normally have Instagram. Once you do that, you can remove Instagram by holding down on Instagram and then click remove app. Once you click remove app, there should be a couple options that show up. And you want to click on remove from home screen. If you click on that, it will remove it from home screen. You can add the shortcut app right where Instagram used to be. And that is how you create app icons on an iPhone. So, I hope this video is helpful. If it was, I'd really appreciate a like and subscribe. Leave any questions you have in the comment section below. I'll do my best to answer them, and I'll see you guys next time.